Hello Twin Flames and welcome to the DM to DF reading for Wednesday. So I'm going to bring in today two powerful decks of cards. Now with this dark night of the soul energy being around, it's about things coming up to the surface for healing. And we know that this has been happening for a while. So the masculines are very aware of what they need to change in their life and what they need to do. So I'm going to bring in the messages from the DM to the F reading this. These are very karmic cards as well. These are by the Enchanting Empress of Light, Oracle and Tarot. And I'm going to bring in the Bridget Road Divine Essentials counterpart connections deck. So what do the masculines want to say? So I feel that's important because it jumped out on its own. What do the masculines want to say today? And these ones are clarifiers. And this one's sticking out too. What do the masculines want to say? Again, see how they're jumping out the deck. Very powerful. So I feel these are clarifiers, extra messages. And these are the main ones. So he's saying to you today, we both need to heal first. These things take time, but it's worth the wait. So the masculine's higher self is reminding you that you're healing too. And that's so true. You know, as a divine feminine, a lot of the time we feel like we're ready and we're healed. And it's all about the masculine making changes. But the feminine changes too. We transform too. We have to leave behind fear too and things we need to let go of. So your masculine saying, we both need to heal first for our permanent union. These things take time, but it's worth the wait. So he's saying our love is meant to be. It's truly worth the wait. And for this card to jump out by itself, he's reminding you, he's teaching you patience and your learning power and you're both finding your way. He's saying, yeah, I'm so angry at myself for all the hurtful things I said to you that day. So there may have been a particular day where he said some nasty things and things turn red. Now, I love that we've got the red energy. George has been talking about this in his readings about the masculines going through a root chakra healing. And if you go over to his channel, um, Blue Eyes Tarot, you'll be able to watch readings from his point of view, from the masculine point of view. But I'm feeling obviously the red is about divine timing because even though we see red when we're angry and I feel the masculines are angry at themselves, you know, they're not angry at you. They may have took something out on you at a specific day, you know, like they may have said nasty things to you on a specific day. It could have been a day where it mattered to you, like a birthday or an event, an occasion, and it really hit you in the feels and stuck inside of you. And he's saying, I'm angry at that, but he's also, you know, learning about divine timing. So the red energy is also connected with Archangel Metatron, the angel of divine timing. And he's saying, I don't want to be around you when I'm angry. I'm not angry at you, I'm angry at me for all the things I've done and said to you on that day. So there's some real energy here where he's holding on to one specific day when he did something or said something that may have caused pain. And he needs to forgive himself from that. And that's causing a dark night of the soul right now. He's saying, I can't stop thinking about you. You're so damn sexy. And there's that red energy again. So, you know, when the masculines are angry... And frustrated, they also get horny. You know, their bodies react to these things in crazy ways. So we say, I'm so horny for you. I can't stop thinking about you. You're so damn sexy. So he's also feeling turned on and there's all this emotion. It's like everything's about to bust out of him. Everything's about to explode out of him like a volcano that's ready to erupt. So, <clears throat> yeah, the blocked throat chakra. <clears throat> so... You know, he can't quite express it, but he's feeling it all. He's feeling it deep inside and his loins and his body, his mind. He feels like he's at breaking point and he's about to break. So these are the cards that clarify us. So he's saying to you, I'm determined to get you back in my life. I know that I have to earn your trust to make that happen. So again, he's saying, I'm sorry that I did those things, said those things on that day. I want to earn your trust back. I want to make it right. I want to fix it. And that really resonates with the masculine reading today as well. The, um, you know, the daily twin flame reading. He's saying to you, I feel empty inside. I need to fill me up before I can give you what you need. So it's like he's saying, I, there needs to be balance in our connection. I need to give back to myself and fill me up so I can fill you up. So he knows that 
he needs to change things have to change and he's saying would you be able to trust me again so again he's kind of saying i hope we can wipe the slate clean start again you know i hope you can forgive me and trust me again because to be in union that has to come in you know if you're watching this reading clearly you want some form of connection with your twin flame physical union a relationship and you may think i just can't forgive him for the things he's done but you have to divine feminine not for him for you so you feel free and at peace when we carry around resentment and bitterness it only hurts ourselves. it's like we're carrying around a hot coal in our hands wayne dyer said that and the only person that hot coal is hurting is ourself and if we hold on to it for long enough it's going to go into the physical body and create dis-ease it's going to taint the blood it's going to cause problems and instead if we let go and we blow on it it's going to heal it's going to feel better time heals i have no idea how to deal with my own emotions never mind yours so the reason why as well he can shut himself down a little bit is because he's struggling to deal with his own emotions and he feels like you're overwhelming him with your emotions sometimes you're not doing that purposefully that's not you that's his perception of it don't take that personally he's saying i just need time out for a moment i need to deal with my own stuff first and he's saying to you i want to wake up beside you every day so the ultimate goal what's worth the wait here is being able to wake up together beside each other every day walk beside each other go to bed together make love be intimate have a life that's what's worth the wait and as a twin flame in union it absolutely is okay it's worth the wait it's worth everything you go through but for this to happen you have to both heal first and that's what takes time so you're both healing fears you know limitations in your mind emotions trust issues feeling empty you know because maybe you're not receiving what you need right now but he's saying i want to give you everything i want to fix it i want to sort everything out because you're so damn sexy and i can't stay away from you or stop thinking about you and i'm determined to do that and help you to trust me again i'm just dealing with a lot of pain right now i'm angry at myself you know for the things i've said and done especially on that day can you forgive me let's make it right I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.